everyone. Hope everyone's doing well. Um, I was going to wait and buy a pin to put the new nib in. Well, guess what I did? Me. <laughs> you already know. I inked it. I polonium, I think is how you say it. Uh, by Nib Lab. I did get it with the satin finish. I'm not too sure if that's it. Other I see. I will let you know on something. It has to be a wider girth, uh, like these O2s, it fits perfectly, but even in this one, it didn't fit, fit correctly. I do like mine even, my pin, and my, uh, the bottom part. So, but other than that, that's all. It's a very beautiful nib. Oh, I'm gonna show you. Uh, Van Diemen's is what's in it, July. It's part of the limited edition. Let's get it in there, Jane. So I gotta look up a little more often. It's gorgeous, gorgeous work. I'm gonna wait till the October comes up. See how that looks. Let me put this out of my way. Okay, I'm gonna spell it out in case I have it wrong. All right, I'm in. Gotta love these crazy nibs. Now, did I try every nib in my um, arsenal, uh, every pin in my arsenal? No, I did not. I tried a few tailored. I tried several uh, Franklin Crusters, but not this one until the end. I tried a few. Um, and like I said, I tried, tried, tried that seven or eight. But I like this thing was on my radar to just show you what. Let's see what it does. I'm not gonna do any pressing because I guess I should write down who did this Ned Lab. He only opens it up once in a while uh, for uh, custom work. I was lucky and I got two. Two. Which one did I do? Did I do this one? It helps if I hold it correctly. There we go. Look at that. Look at that ball of fire. Isn't it gorgeous? I love it. Of course the pen is. See, it's just, a, it's a very cool nib. I do like my stacks. And I do like my wide ones. But it, you can see, I don't know if you guys can try to see it better than me. But it looks like there's three pieces there, or it's how it's been ground. How many do I have from Nib Lab? Uh, quite a few, quite a few. I've been very happy with all of them. I just wanted to warn you on, on this one, um, and with the, so that could be Ed and I, I might have bought an Ed and I, I don't remember, I just, and that's the same with this one, that's why they're both in the Franklin Kristoff. Set for a while. This is a fine faux flex, like anything else, go slow enough, it's perfect. Yeah, and I might have to change the ink. This came with the same time as the other one. Here's the over feed. See that? At the night. Hammered. Gorgeous. I like a nose. And that to me isn't priming, it's just. When was the last time I used that one? 
several days. But see, like those others, I'd had to crime them already. So that's why I had two going in. The nib lab. This is like, because you're right, you're right and right on this little section, and it's just like, Tip it, and that's where you get. Like that stuff. So I just wanted to warn you on that. There's no problem, especially if you have Franklin Kustos O2s. Uh, if not, they're gorgeous pins. I'm not a, I thought I realized I'm not a clipped girl. You know I should be. We all should have some clips. Any of the big manufacturers usually have the clip. But the little ones usually don't. So that is my newest nibs. I have to say nibs because that's that came the same time. I was just going to save this one. But I'm glad I did try it out because... And I'll try it out with, I'd say, ooh, that one might go good with this. We'll see. If not, it has its home, and it's going to be... Oh, let me put that one away. It's not about the fine full flex. Fine full flex. And, you know, it's just as I've said before. It's not necessary. The nib. It could be the ink. Because this one looks like it's shady. I don't know what that is. I know that's the third ink. I didn't realize one had um, shimmer in it. And that's not always good. So did I get everything? Palooza Nid Lab, Franklin Kristoff pin. Oh, I didn't write down. I talked about it, but I didn't write it. I should write it. Let's do it this way. Then. Limited edition, July. I am definitely waiting for their October and then their December. So that's what's going on. That's, that's my extra fine flex, which I've already posted that one a couple videos ago. Anyways, I want to say thank you for watching. I would definitely want to get this out for you guys. See, this is another pin. It's not a pillow. That's a pin holder. Uh, it's just something that... It kind of adds a little bit to the photo. And uh, we'll see what I get. I try to tape it. I don't know. It might be next weekend. Uh, I get home Friday night. Uh, probably not then. But yeah, it might be Saturday night. Uh, I'll be posting my 30 inks, 30 days all over the place. But Anyways, and then of course I'll do a recap and all that, that's what I thought. And you know, I love, I love the Orlando Pin Show. It's an hour from me, and who can't love that? Uh, and the people that put it on are really, really nice. And it's just a fun show. It's, I know it's the only one, but you can usually tell by how they run it. Anyways, I want to say thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video. I know, I've never said that before. Why did I do that? Well, I do hope you enjoyed. You know that. And um, how did I... Oh, 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 that's why I'm getting MRI. I can't move my arm. <laughs> thank you for watching. Have a great day.